Russian Mole's upgrading Su-57 to 6th generation fighter jet. The Su-57 has the potential to be a 6th generation fighter jet, the former head of the Russian Aerospace Force claims. Russia's first indigenously designed and built 5th generation stealth fighter, the Su-57, could be turned into a 6th generation fighter aircraft, the former head of the Russian Aerospace Force, Viktor Bondarev told TASS news agency on November. This is actually a splendid plane and it can embrace both 5th and 6th generation features. It has huge modernization potential, Bondarev, now chairman of the Federation Council Defense and Security Committee, said. Importantly, it is the best among the existing versions by its stealth characteristics. It incorporates all the best that is available in modern aviation science both in Russia and in the world, he added. As I reported in July 2016, Russian defense officials have repeatedly claimed that hardware elements designed for a future sixth-generation fighter have been tested on the Su-57 prototype, including flight and navigation systems as well as advanced electronic warfare and radar systems. Russia revealed for the first time the design of a new sixth-generation fighter aircraft in March 2016, see, Russia reveals first design of new sixth-generation fighter. The new aircraft is slated to be available in manned and unmanned configuration, and could take to the air for the first time in the late 2020s, according to Russian defense officials. Meanwhile, work on the Su-57 is continuing. Bonarek cautioned that it will take time for the new aircraft to be introduced into service. In the first year, the Aerospace Force won't get 20 or 15 planes. It will get only 2 or 3 and so on, he said on November 1st. The service is currently testing 9 Su-57 prototypes with 2 additional aircraft expected to be delivered to the service by the end 2017. Doubts remain as to whether the Su-57 is genuinely a 5th generation fighter aircraft. The Su-57 reportedly is a multi-role, single-seat, twin-engine air superiority deep air support fighter poised to replace the Russian Aerospace Force's MiG-29s and Su-27s. The Su-57 will be armed with beyond visual range air-to-air -air missiles as well as a VAR-2 ground missiles including the extended range KH-35 UE tactical cruise missile, I explained previously. It can also be armed with nuclear-capable cruise missiles. One of the chief technical problems that still need to be resolved is designing and producing a next-generation engine for the Su-57. As of now, Su-57 prototypes are equipped with a derivative of the Saturn Al 41 F1S engine, dubbed Al 41 F1, an engine also installed on the Sukhoi Su-35S flanker E. While the Su-57 was slated to conduct its maiden flight this year, a new engine the next generation Saturnized Ely I-30 will reportedly not be ready until 2020. According to Russian defense sources, experimental design work on the Su-57 will not be completed until 2019.